The render network has started burning render tokens. Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Doc in today's video I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about the render network burning render tokens, when it started, what's its potential and how's the future looking. I'm also gonna give you a short term price prediction of the render price and of course I'm not gonna talk too much and get straight into the point of this video. So the first topic I wanna talk about is the render network has started the burn of render tokens. A couple weeks ago I made a video about the burning mechanism being live but they didn't mention any burning yet until today. As you can see the burning of thousands and thousands of render tokens has started and of course what you have to remember is that the AI and machine learning integration is coming soon. So this is purely from rendering. If you don't know what I'm talking about, in RMP004 there was a proposal of the introduction to an API of the render network that would allow rendered network nodes to be utilized for compute operations. What this basically means is that it will greatly expand the user base and use cases of the render network as a whole pushing it beyond just rendering functionality and into the expanding market of AI and machine learning tools. So for those who don't know how big AI and machine learning can be, just take this example of ChatGPT which costs 21 million per month to operate. So just one language learning model combined with the render burning mechanism would mean that every month almost 6 million render tokens or over 1% of the total render supplies would be burned. So this would basically cause a major supply shock, a lot of hype and would pump render to double and even triple digit faster than you can ever imagine. So what do you remember about the last bull run and burning mechanism? Well, it's BNB. If we didn't know yet, Binance Coin actually used kind of the same burning mechanism where they would actually use fees of the Binance exchange to buy BNB coin and burn it. So this caused a big big hype and actually pumped BNB coin to over 100 billion in market cap. So if we would compare this with render as you can see on the screen, this would mean a render of almost $300. And this time render of course is not backed like BNB by real world usage of the Binance exchange. No, it's by real world usage of the render network for rendering and soon AI and machine learning but there's of course way more than just language learning models this great example with of course the big big hype of the apple vision pro is apple immerse video which is basically a remarkable new entertaining format developed by apple featuring 180 degrees 3d 8K recordings made with spatial audio. This spatial audio and spatial video is something we're gonna see definitely a lot of in the future. So if you just take this example, it looks incredible. Spatial audio, spatial visuals, like you're actually there. And this kind of spatial thing uses so much GPU power, you have no idea. There's a reason why Apple is only selling 80 to 160,000 units because they need the GPUs, they need the GPU power. So more and more developers are going to do this and the render network with its million of idle GPUs will be more than important. And there was actually a really good tweet this week of someone summarizing what the potential of the render network. So Dark Knight actually said AI, AR, spatial computing, holographic media, the metaverse, Everything which is an upcoming narrative that leads to increased GPU consumption will fuel renders growth. So the render network has been at the forefront of this narrative since its inception and is confident that with this upcoming bull run they will be a leader in the GPU computing industry. And so another key narrative that has been gaining momentum is Deepin, which is basically a decentralized physical infrastructure. I will make a whole video about this and telling you why render is the biggest one and will be the biggest one by far. So another key thing I want to see from this tweet is, however, given that we're only 
early on ChatGPT and AI as it's only a year old, the potential to explore and capitalize on emerging fields is exponential. And I 100% agree with this. Like it's only been a year since we're discovering AI and AI is only already this big. Can you imagine what AI will do in the next three to five years? I truly think that the render potential is way bigger than the crypto bull run in the upcoming one, two years and will continue to grow over the next five to 10 years. And before I give you my short term price prediction or how the render price will go in my opinion, if you want to buy render Bitcoin and over 300 plus crypto and also get up to $30,000 in rewards as shown on screen for just depositing and trading crypto. Just go to the top of the description and click on the partner Bybit link. Once you're at the Bybit page, be sure to use my referral code or use my link to be sure you will be able to get up to 30,000 in deposit rewards and even compete with competitions with over 2.2 million USD in prize pools. So don't miss out on this opportunity and make an account with my link. So now what do I think about the short term render price? So what we saw last year in May actually looks a lot like now. So we had a great pump, then two big red candles, two big red candles, followed by two greens, a red, which is actually exactly the same thing now, and then followed by a lot of red. But this was purely, this was a correction from the top, just like this was the same thing happening. And this was purely because the entire crypto market was going down. And even though we have no idea what's going to happen with Bitcoin, there's a lot and lot of hype coming for Render very soon. And I summarize this in an easy tweet. So the first thing which will come on February 2nd is the Apple Vision Pro release. So basically, if you didn't know yet, last year this major pump from like $1, even less than $1 to $2.80 came from the event which showcased the Apple Vision Pro. So I'm expecting a lot of hype as well from this release to render this year. The second thing which still hasn't happened yet is a Solana migration by centralized exchanges. So the team has been saying that they have been talking to centralized exchanges and this is very, very big. I made a video about it last week. So if you want to know why this is very bullish, be sure to check that out after this video. The next two things are the open compute client which we talked about early in this video which will enable AI training and machine learning and NVIDIA GTC 2024 which is basically the biggest AI conference in the world where the CEO of Render will be talking about Render its roadmap so expect a lot and a lot of hype of this. This is basically happening on March 18th till the 20th so a lot of hype is coming to Render. Of course Bitcoin could drag us down a little bit more like it did actually in the summer of 2023 but with the upcoming hype I'm expecting a lot in the next two months and kind of low key I'm going for all time high which is $9 but of course it depends on Bitcoin if Bitcoin crashes to 32k or something crazy well you know we cannot do anything about it but if Bitcoin remains the same and goes a little bit bullish and we get these bullish bullish events for render I'm expecting a lot of it in the next one two months so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like if you did. Also follow me at TheRealDuck on Twitter to know when I talk about crypto, post videos, give tips and you can always ask me anything on Twitter as well. Also click on the screen right now if you want to know when to buy a render to maximize your crypto profits. Subscribe for more crypto content and YouTube. Until next time.